field bus is the name of a family of industrial computer network protocols used for real-time distributed control, standardized as IEC 61158. A complex automated industrial system a euro such as manufacturing assembly line a euro usually needs a distributed control system a euro an organized hierarchy of controller systems a euro to function. In this hierarchy, there is usually a human machine interface at the top, where an operator can monitor or operate the system. This is typically linked to a middle layer of programmable logic controllers via a non-time critical communications system. At the bottom of the control chain is the field bus that links the PLCs to the components that actually do the work, such as sensors, actuators, electric motors, console lights, switches, valves and contactors. Description Field bus is an industrial network system for real-time distributed control. It is a way to connect instruments in a manufacturing plant. Field bus works on a network structure which typically allows daisy chain, star, ring, branch, and tree network topologies. Previously, computers were connected using RS-232 by which only two devices could communicate. This would be the equivalent of the currently used 4 to 20 megampers communication scheme which requires that each device has its own communication point at the controller level, while the field bus is the equivalent of the current LAN type connections, which require only one communication point at the controller level and allow multiple of analog and digital points to be connected at the same time. This reduces both the length of the cable required and the number of cables required. Furthermore, since devices that communicate through field bus require a microprocessor, multiple points are typically provided by the same device. Some field bus devices now support control schemes such as PID control on the device side instead of forcing a controller to do the processing. History, BIFUS, the oldest commonly used field bus technology is BIFUS. BIFUS was created by Intel Corporation to enhance use of multi-bus systems in industrial systems by separating slow I.O. functions from faster memory access. In 1983, Intel created the 8044 BIFUS microcontroller by adding field bus firmware to its existing 8051 microcontroller. BIFUS uses EIA485 at the physical layer, with two twisted pairs, one for data and the other for clocking and signals. Use of SDLC at the data link layer permits 250 nodes on one segment with a total distance of 13.2 km. BIFUS has one master node and multiple slaves, with slaves only responding to requests from the master. BIFUS does not define routing at the network layer. The 8044 permits only a relatively small data packet, but embeds an efficient set of RAC tasks and the ability to develop custom RAC tasks. In 1990, the IEEE adopted BIFUS as the microcontroller system serial controlled bus. Today BIFUS is maintained by the BEUG, BIFUS European Users Group. Standardization, although field bus technology has been around since 1988, with the completion of the ISAS 50.02 standard, the development of the international standard took many years. In 1999, the IEC SC 65 CWG 6 Standards Committee met to resolve difference in the draft IEC field bus standard. The result of this meeting was the initial form of the IEC 61158 standard with eight different protocol sets called types as follows, Type 1 Foundation Field Bus H1, Type 2 Control Net, Type 3 Profibus, Type 4 P Net, Type 5 Foundation Field Bus HSE, Type 6 Swift Net. Type 7 World FIP, Type 8 Interbus, this form of standard was first developed for the European Common Market, concentrates less on commonality, and achieves its primary purpose a Euro elimination of restraint of trade between nations. Issues of commonality are now left to the international consortia that support each of the field bus standard types. Almost as soon as it was approved, the IEC standards development work ceased and the committee was dissolved. A new IEC committee SC65CMT9 was formed to resolve the conflicts in form and substance within the more than 4,000 pages of IEC 61158. The work on the above protocol types is substantially complete. New protocols, 
such as for safety field buses or real-time Ethernet field buses are being accepted into the definition of the international field bus standard during a typical five-year maintenance cycle. Both foundation field bus and profibus technologies are now commonly implemented within the process control field, both for new developments and major refits. In 2006, China saw the largest FF systems installations at Nanhai and Seco, each with around 15,000 field bus devices connected. IEC 61158 specification, there were many competing technologies for field bus and the original hope for one single unified communications mechanism has not been realized. This should not be unexpected since field bus technology needs to be implemented differently in different applications. Automotive field bus is functionally different from process plant control. The final edition of IEC standard IEC 61158 allows eight technologies. These are the sum hierarchic layer of the automation protocols. IEC 61158 consists of the following parts, under the general title Digital Data Communications for Measurement and Control a Euro field bus for use in industrial control systems, Part 1. Overview and Guidance for the IEC 61158 Series, Part 2, Physical Layer Specification and Service Definition, Part 3, Data Link Service Definition, Part 4, Data Link Protocol Specification, Part 5, Application Layer Service Definition, Part 6, Application Layer Protocol Specification, Standards, There are a wide variety of competing field bus standards. Some of the most widely used ones include AS Interface, CAN, EtherCAT, Foundation Fieldbus, Interbus, Lonworks, Modbus, Profibus, Bifus, Componet, Safety Bus P, Rapinet. See list of automation protocols for more examples. Cost advantage The amount of cabling required is much lower in Fieldbus than in 4 20 MA installations. This is because many devices share the same set of cables in a multi-drop fashion rather than requiring a dedicated set of cables per device as in the case of 4-20 Omega per devices. Moreover, several parameters can be communicated per device in a field bus network whereas only one parameter can be transmitted on a 4-20 Omega pair connection. Fieldbus also provides a good foundation for the creation of a predictive and proactive maintenance strategy. The diagnostics available from field bus devices can be used to address issues with devices before they become critical problems. Networking, with the exception of ARCNET, which was conceived as early as 1975 for office connectivity and later found users in industry, the majority of field bus standards were developed in the 1980s and became fully established in the marketplace during the mid 1990s. In the United States, Allen Bradley developed standards that eventually grew into DeviceNet and ControlNet. In Europe, Siemens and other manufacturers developed a protocol which evolved into Profibus. During the 1980s, to solve communication problems between different control systems and cars, the German company Robert Bosch GmbH first developed the controller area network. The concept of CAN was that every device can be connected by a single set of wires, and every device that is connected can freely exchange data with any other device. CAN soon migrated into the factory automation marketplace. Despite each technology sharing the generic name of field bus the various field bus are not readily interchangeable. The differences between them are so profound that they cannot be easily connected to each other. To understand the differences among field bus standards, it is necessary to understand how field bus networks are designed. With reference to the OSI model, field bus standards are determined by the physical media of the cabling, and layers 1, 2 and 7 of the reference model. For each technology the physical medium and the physical layer standards fully describe, in detail, the implementation of bit timing, synchronization, encoding-decoding, band rate, bus length and the physical connection of the transceiver to the communication wires. The data link layer standard is responsible for fully specifying how messages are assembled ready for transmission by the physical layer, error handling, message filtering and bus arbitration and how these standards are to be implemented in hardware. The application layer standard, 
in general defines how the data communication layers are interfaced to the application that wishes to communicate. It describes message specifications, network management implementations and response to the request from the application of services. Layers 3 to 6 are not described in field by standards. Technical committees, with representatives of many different companies, have been responsible for turning the original specifications into international ISO standards. Berry, among others, reports that work is underway to implement a common field bus protocol. This will entail a common set of application layer services that can be provided regardless of the lower layer implementation details. Although very much in its infancy, it is expected that this protocol may become reality by 2010. Whether designed for low-level sensor communications or high-level machine connectivity, a field bus is an important enabling technology for an open architecture controller. Features Different field buses offer different sets of features and performance. It is difficult to make a general comparison of field bus performance because of fundamental differences in data transfer methodology. In the comparison table below it is simply noted if the field bus in question typically supports data update cycles of 1 millisecond or faster. Process field bus versus device networks, it should be noted that requirements of field bus networks for process automation applications are different from the requirements of field bus networks found in discrete manufacturing applications such as automotive manufacturing, where large numbers of discrete sensors are used including motion sensors, position sensors, and so on. Discrete field bus networks are often referred to as device networks. Ethernet and field bus Recently a number of Ethernet-based industrial communication systems have been established, most of them with extensions for real-time communication. These have the potential to replace the traditional field buses in the long term. Here is a partial list of the new Ethernet-based industrial communication systems, AFDX, EtherCAT. Ethernet IP, Ethernet PowerLink, Foundation HSE, BACnet, Profnet IO, Profnet IRT, SafetyNet P, Circos 3, Tethernet, VARAN, RAPENET. For details, see the article on Industrial Ethernet, Safety. Field bus can be used for systems which must meet safety relevant standards like IECA 61508 or ENA 954 1. Depending on the actual protocol, Field bus can provide measures like counters, CRCs, echo, timeout, unique sender and receiver IDs or cross-check. Ethernet IP and Circos 3 both use the CIP safety protocol, Ethernet PowerLink uses open safety, while Foundation Field bus and Profibus can address SIL2 and SIL3 process safety applications. In January 2006, the Fieldbus Foundation announced that Chaw v. Rainland Industry Service GmbH, Automation, Software and Information Technology, a global, independent and accredited testing agency, had granted protocol type approval for its safety specifications. The Foundation Technical Specifications, Safety Instrumented Functions are in compliance with International Electrotechnical Commission 61508 standard requirements up to and including, safety integrity level 3. Market, in process control systems, the market is dominated by foundation field bus and profibus power. Both technologies use the same physical layer but are not interchangeable. As a general guide, applications which are controlled and monitored by PLCs tend towards profibus, and applications which are controlled and monitored by a DCS tend towards foundation field bus. Profibus technology is made available through Profibus International with headquarters in Karlsruhe, Germany. Foundation Fieldbus technology is owned and distributed by the Fieldbus Foundation of Austin, Texas. See also, Parallel Redundancy Protocol, Media Redundancy Protocol, Notes. References, Shava, Andrew Fieldbus, The Foundation for Field Control Systems Control Engineering, May, 47 Euro 50. Furnace, Harry Digital Communications provides. Control Engineering, January, 23 Euro 25. Furnace, Harry Fieldbus, The Differences Start from the Bottom Up Control Engineering, March, 49 Euro 51. Fui, 
Ken Field bus hits the road chemical engineering, September, 37 a Euro 41. Johnson, Dick the future of field bus at milestone 1995 control engineering, December, 49 a Euro 52. Loose, Graham when can the process industry use field bus? Control and instrumentation, May, 63 a Euro 65. Spear. Mike Field bus faces up to first trials process engineering, March, P36. Lasher, Richard J. Field bus advancements and their implications control engineering, July, 33 Euro 35. Pearson, Linda L. Broader Field bus standards will improve system functionality control engineering, November, 38 Euro 39. Powell, James and Henry Van Deeland, catching the process field bus. An Introduction to Profibus for Process Automation WWW Measure Max Car. O'Neill, Mike. Advances in Field Bus, Process Industry Informer, January, 36 a Euro 37. N.P. Mahalik. P.R. More Field Bus Technology Based, Distributed Control and Process Industries, a case study with Lon Works Technology Arcade Advisory Group Foundation Field Bus Safety Instrumented Functions Forge the Future of Process Safety, Bibliography, Bob, Michael Will Maintenance Learn to Love Field Bus? Control Engineering, January, 19. Bob, Michael Summer, 1994, Another Field Bus Delay, Schneider's DPV, and Open Systems Control Engineering, July, 29. Gokush, Steve Another Scenario, Maintenance Will Learn to Love Field Bus Control Engineering, June, 112 Euro 114. Gunnell, Jeff Analyzer Links Can Use Field Bus Control and Instrumentation, March, 33 Euro 35. Hodgkinson, Jeff Communications Are We Listening? Process Engineering, Instrumentation Supplement 1994, S19 Euro S21. Jones, Jeremy can field bus survive? Control and instrumentation, August, 25 a Euro 26. Carriage, Brian Network Vendors agonize over field bus standard Eden, April 28, 45 a Euro 46. Ratch, Jay Namur says yes to field bus technology and the promise of reduces costs control and instrumentation, September, 33 a Euro 34. Reeve. Allen Field Bus a Euro are users involved. Control and instrumentation, August, 25 a Euro 26. Spear, Mike a plant view of field bus and use process engineering, April, 38 a Euro 39. Spear, Mike Field Bus ready to start the last lap? Process engineering, April, 37. External links, USA, Field Bus Foundation. Foundation Field Bus and User Councils, Middle East, Foundation Field Bus and User Council, Middle East, Australia, Foundation Field Bus and User Council Australia Incorporated, Independent Organizations, Iran Iranian Field Bus Foundation, Manufacturing Systems Integration Research Institute at Loughborough, UK, the PNET Field Bus.